There it is with the everything loosened off and that just lifts out so you've got access in there now to get at the uh, at the uh, windscreen wiper the washer now what I've done I'm, I'm changing the uh, the nozzle for the uh, for the you can see it uh, then I've, I put a bit of gaffer tape over it to stop the new one poking through the old one I just chiseled off from the outside because uh, it's difficult to get in here quite a poor design from Land Rover this bracket is in the way you can't get your fingers in you can't get a socket in and you need a long a, a deep socket to get to get that on so what I'm going to do if you look there's just a single spot well there I'm going to drill that out but before I do it I'll put a uh, a hole through for a self tapper so that I can just fold it back in again this hopefully when I fold it back out will give me access to get a socket onto that to change it it's an absolute pig of a job otherwise uh, I put two centre punch marks there one in the centre of the spot weld so I can drill it out uh, maybe there should be two uh, but I, there's only one on mine but I put a second one there so that I can uh, put a self tapper the spot weld drilled out and the small hole ready to put a self tapper in the event of having to do this job. It's uh, peeled back and you can see right down there you can see the uh, the uh, end. This will allow you to not only get the nut on but also get the, the uh, hose back onto the end which is another pig of a job. As you can see I've jammed the bra new brass nut there in with a piece of tape so that it doesn't go further down so I can, I can start it and I've got this one which is uh, obviously a universal one which will take the the bend and allow me to tighten it. There it is tightened up uh, just far far easier. I struggled for, for hours trying to do it before and resorted to this method. And with that uh, bracket out of the way, with a pair of long nose pliers, just pushing the rubber hose back on again makes it so much easier and you can see exactly what you're doing in that stroke. The ignition on and just check that there's no leaks with the, that's that, working well, nothing dripping down, perfectly alright. is back again. Uh, I, I did pop that plug out uh, just to give me a bit more access. Um, no need to obviously that hole, the bracket is there. I put the self tapper in because it, to prevent the, the uh, it may get a buzz or, and when you're on the road uh, metal just slightly touching so that's pinched up so it's uh, strong enough. Hope this helps you.